in the previous video we have already seen that how we can uh, let the services to talk to each other using the AWS uh, ECS service connect service uh, feature I would say now the thing is that we will test whether that is working fine or not in this video okay so first of all we have to SSH into those or one of the service I will try going into both and we will test uh, we will try to ping or call the APIs of the other service from the terminal of that so how you have to do that one go to VS code please for me inside the VS code go to the AWS configure and select over here the ECS service and you can see that ECS service has that one cluster and one cluster has multiple services running if I'm selecting one of the services it shows that that container is running fine just right click this one and see run command in container or open terminal hey I can see those two options but those options are not available as a clickable something like that why because at the time of creation the uh, creating the ECS service you have to like add a execute command enabled so how to do that one then only that service will be available right so now just type AWS ECS update service command so AWS ECS update service hyphen hyphen cluster bookshop bookshop why bookshop see this one bookshop is the cluster name that cluster name service name what service I want to add uh, uh, execution command is this one the user one and the region whatever the region I have to add enable execute command and I have to tell the service hey forcefully re-update that one so just uh, now the thing is that before hitting that one now if I am showing you this one see this one is like that is in active state the user API one as soon as I hit that one this will be redeployed one more time like this now if I go and refresh this see this one started in progress now the second thing is that see now if I go down see enable execute command happens to be true now <coughs> if you go and check the uh, role which I was talking about here so ECS task role so execution task role so you have to add this particular command right then only that will be uh, that that service will be having uh, permission to you know allow that uh, service to run in the terminal right now you just need to wait for some time let me quickly go and try checking that one now so till the time that runs I'm gonna go press Q and then try running one more time but this time I'm gonna select different service that is not users but this time will be it will be having books so telling the same command hey enable the execution enable execute command okay so let me go and just yeah that is done now if I try refreshing those two yep so it will take some time again now if I go yep those two are in progress first one ran successfully uh, why is uh, showing the second one because the previous one was the old one and it was just uh, draining that one just deleting the instance so soon we'll be having just one on one and both are running fine see one on one okay now just keep refreshing that one now if see user APIs is working fine now if I go back to VS code here and try refreshing this one first right click this one now I'm getting the open terminal okay just hit it open terminal like that yes okay so you already got now type curl hit enter you should see this command if you are not seeing this command that's why I was telling you that inside this docker file when you are pushing that one you should need to say that docker file at the time of running please do install install curl inside your ECS Fargate instance so that you can ping to the other service right now I've already here now let's see what uh, we can do so uh, we have had like uh, 
uh, if I'm going here and then 9000 right so books was working on 9000 so if I go back um, so type curl and then uh, select let me quickly check yeah both are working fine so let me go in the books go to configuration and networking select this endpoint and trying to try to hit that one space curl slash users sorry books one yeah book not found i haven't created the book and everything yeah but it's pointing that hey uh, that is that is pinging to other service that's how you can communicate to the other service now if you are uh, you wanted to check the other service to communicate with the other one no problem so just not trying to refresh that one quickly uh yep so that is there it start running yes so this one is books okay now curl same thing uh, but this time uh, we have to get the url which is there for users which is this one configuration and select this one and then select books sorry uh, user because i'm inside the books yep so that's how you can start intercommunicating with uh, the services that's that much simple um i couldn't find the document and everything but this is the scenario which i was uh, you know, telling you about so guys please please uh, follow all the instructions which I've, I've given you until now until this eighth video i think so uh, yeah so and you will be having all uh, all understanding how you can intercommunicate and something like that in the next video i'm gonna show you that how application load balancer work and you will see the entire scenarios running both application work and fine and how to how route based working and everything works behind the scene so yeah so that is aws ecs service connect feature which is very helpful for let the uh, services communicate with each other so if you do like this particular video please do subscribe to my channel that keeps me motivated please do like just wanted to share you one more point is that uh, if you go and just google saying that youtube uh, programmer something like that and then i don't know whether that works or not <laughs> but uh, do, 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 or you can go to my github link and then uh, the one which i was talking about was um yeah so i'm gonna add the uh, youtube link over here as well but uh, okay so one of the best video how to like how to install docker on aws ec2 because that was one, one of the best popular videos which was uh, running fine so that is my youtube channel if you go inside this one yeah so this is the one which i was talking Hi, about everyone. guys just letting you know that over here most of the people haven't subscribed to my channel so i'm like very keen to know that uh, if you could subscribe to my channel i need your motivation guys over here i need more subs uh, subscriptions so that i can uh, give you uh, as much as stuff i can okay so please do subscribe and do let me know if you have any questions thanks for watching